Hey, my name is Camilla Peterson. I am a professional triathlete. So that is my job. I started 10 years ago in 2010. And I did it mostly because I needed a goal in life. So that's why not really many believed that I could do it. And that's also one of the biggest challenges that I like when people don't believe that I can do something. So I did my first uh, triathlon in 2010 and then it went pretty fast. I was on the national team. I won a couple of races and then I won my first European Championships in 2011. I was second at the World Championships and then I became European Champion on full Ironman. But one month before I had a little accident. I was out biking and I was still new in the game. So at that time I was actually in my best shape of my life. Um, but I was out biking and then some kids uh, came, uh, ran over across the street and I crashed on my bike and got some really bad skull fractures and broke some different bones like ribs, collarbone, hip. But the worst part was the injuries in my head with the two open skull fractures. So the doctors put me in to introduce coma and I was actually in coma for three weeks. Uh, after three weeks, I started easily to woke up, but I wasn't told the best odds for my, for my life. I was told I could never walk again. That's why I was sitting in a wheelchair. Uh, from that day on, I started my hardest fight of the life. I could talk, but only had a few words I could say. And I remembered small things, but not many. So my first fight was I wanted to walk again. And even though the doctor said I couldn't, so I was trying every day, 10,000 times a day to get on my feet. But every time I got up, I fell down. And then I just got up again, I fell down. So after 10 days, a million of times I fell down and got up again, I could stand on my feet, but I couldn't move my feet because again, I have so much damage in my brain. Anything is possible if you just are willing to sacrifice for it, if you're willing to also stand up again every time you fall. In one year after my accident, I actually won the world championships. So I came out of coma on the 22nd of September and I won the world championship the 23rd of September. Um, but for me, it was the biggest thing I've ever won was not actually winning the world championships, but more I was at the start line at the world championships one year after I was in coma. I always tell people, Look always at the positive side, because life is not easy, but it's your own choice. If you make it easy or positive, or you only bring the negative sides with you. So life is a gift, and we really gotta remember that we wake up every day and we can walk. We have to appreciate it. We have to remember that it is vulnerable life, and it can be gone in a second. So it's also important that we remember the people we care about and love, that we let them know sometimes and people forget it. And just take every day as a normal day, but every day is a special day.